At the end of 2021, there were 155 refuge and safe house spaces for victims of domestic abuse. A review carried out by the child and family agency TUSLA, published today, identified an urgent need for at least 60 more. The Minister for Justice has said 82 new and replacement family spaces will now be prioritised in 10 locations and work will begin to source refuge provision in a number of counties that have none. This will be exactly what people need. The bricks and mortar is one piece of it, making sure they have that safe space, but you need the wraparound supports and services and you need the follow-on as well. Where do these mainly women, but men as well, and children go? How do we provide that support? And that's where the national strategy comes in. That national strategy on domestic, sexual and gender-based violence is now due to be published in April. Today, the Minister for Justice met stakeholders here at the National Concert Hall to discuss a draft and to outline a proposal for a new statutory agency. The proposed agency would require legislation, staffing and funding. It would answer to the Minister for Justice, would report to a dedicated Cabinet subcommittee and would be responsible for the delivery of services, ensuring standards and leading awareness campaigns and research. The thing that we are welcoming above all today is a full straight statement that Ireland needs a fully functional infrastructure from national high level government and policy response right down to community level. I think the framework that's been suggested in terms of the agency that needs I think more exploration and we need a bit more detail behind that. From tomorrow citizens will be invited to have their say when the Department of Justice opens a public consultation on the proposed strategy on domestic, sexual and gender-based violence. Laura Fletcher, RTE News.